opinions on the feasibility of the Faraday future FF91 are mixed, to say the least. You have the slightly NSFW video above, for example, pointing out everything wrong with the electric car. You also have people saying we should keep an open mind. There's no question that the automaker's message team is relentlessly positive, but that's often a sure sign that you should put on your skeptical spectacles and take a closer look. A good place to start is the video at the top of this post, which comes to us from Adrienne Jeffers at the outline. She does a fine job fulfilling the promise of the video's title, Everything Wrong with Faraday Futures Tesla Killer. Well, maybe not everything. There are still the side mirrors or, actually, the side cameras. Hugely popular with the concept car set, side cameras are still not approved in the US for production vehicles, so that's at least one thing that FF will have to change before bringing the FF91 to market. Either that or get the law changed. But let's get to the gist of Jeffrey's video, which points out that FF has a mounting pile of problems, from the departure of executives to the failure of the FF91 to park itself during a live demonstration at the C's reveal event. While the company did succeed in an unverified time trial between the FF91 and a Bentley Bentga, a Ferrari 488 GTB, and a Tesla Model X during the launch event, that's not enough to cancel out the technical failure on stage. At least the race, such as it was, redefined D, car unveiling S, as part of its aggressive communication, according to Automotive News, 